<clears throat> this is the design of gambling, communicating about gambling. If you walk into casinos, casinos represent the establishment and the manifestation of money. Money is not the paper or the coin. Money is the casinos and the banking systems, the buildings, the actual buildings. That is the manifestation of money. Casinos and banks. Now, the banks are the money that are used by the governments to control society and the world. Casinos are the manifestation of money that control and enslave and empower human beings minds. So the banking system, the banks, are the controller of the lives of human beings. The casinos, manifestation of money, that, that are the controller of the mind of human beings. It is the way the system has been set up in and of this world. Now, Let's look at gambling specifically. Why there is a addiction to gambling. <clears throat> Before we get to gambling, I have to get to perspective of money. Human beings require and need money to survive. Casino seems like a place where there is hope, where there might be an opportunity and a chance to get money. So the establishment of the casino as money is based on hope and chance and luck. Thus, human beings go gambling. From a starting point of hope, the requirement and need to survive, and a quick and a fast way out. Now you have your banks, the manifestation of the actual bowling of the banks, and you have the manifestation of the casino. Now both are manifestations of money in this world that are controlling and enslaving human beings. The banks are the manifestation of money that control human beings' lives. Placing them into a central position of the requirement to survive. Because there's not enough money, the casino stands before them as a presentation of possible hope, luck. So human beings from the banks that control them in the center placed into a survival requirement and need walk to the casino. In the casino they are locked into the system of hope, of getting money a quick, easy and fast way. And there will only be a select few human beings that occasionally wins a lot of money, only but a handful. And the rest of the human beings go in absolute hope and faith and trust that maybe, possibly, I will also be able to win. And that is the point that traps. So therefore, the casino, together with the banking system, is a religious construct. 
It is another religion-based system. Have a look. You have the world, you have yourself, and you have God. Now, excuse me, you have God, you have yourself, and then you have the church, the Bible, and prayer. God is as the banking system of this world that is controlling your life. You, you live your life by God's will. The casino is the church, prayer, and Bible because you go in there, you get locked into the system of praying, going to the church and reading the Bible because everyone, there's a select few occasional human beings that is experiencing miracles. And then all the other human beings go to church, pray, worship, read Bible to maybe, hopefully, win the jackpot of receiving a miracle from God. And that's how human beings are trapped in the religious system of a God existing, apparently. The exact same goes for money. There is no difference. Thus, where does the gambling, wanting to gamble, wanting to get money come from? Firstly, survival. Making it in this world. Hoping to win a jackpot because there are other people that have already won jackpots. Wishing to have more money to be able to, be, to live more comfortably and more better in this world. The same is with religion. Human beings going to the churches, Bible, worship, prayer to receive a miracle so that their life can be better. So they can survive easily, more easily, and live more easily. Thus, human beings. I would suggest to look at your relationship with gambling. Because gambling is a religious construct system. First, make sure when you gamble, you're not gambling to win money. You're not gambling to survive. You're not gambling to have your life be better and more livable and more acceptable. That you're not gambling by money being your God. That you're not gambling, that gambling is your God controlling your life. Because if gambling and money controls your life, you're stuck in the religious system of this world. All systems in this world, human beings, are based on a religious foundation, just like gambling. Thank you very much. This is the design of gambling.